Okay, so this is actually really hard to do with music. I, in Vancouver, um, on that fourth and final run, home Olympics, and I'm in first place. And I remember pushing as hard as I can, driving down the bobsleigh track. And once you get through corner 13, it's corner 50-50. And once we'd got through that part, I knew, okay, we were homebound. But again, I didn't know how far ahead or behind we were from competitors. So I crossed the finish line and everybody's cheering. And again, I hadn't seen a clock. So I don't know if I had won, not won. I remember, I mean, it's in Canada. So everyone's going to cheer. Even if you just screwed up and you've lost everything, um, everyone's cheering. And so I remember coming up the finish line and normally the coaches have like a one or a two or a three fingers of your first, second, third position. And I saw no hands and no fingers and everybody's cheering. And I'm like, did I just like, did I just throw everything away and end up losing everything? And of course we stopped the sled and I still haven't seen a clock or a time or a coach or another teammate. Um, and we get out of the sled and the coach comes running up the finish line and I had to actually ask. I was like, what happened? He's like, you won. And instantaneously, it was an amazing emotional feeling of just every single thing that you could possibly imagine flooding in and, and a little bit of disbelief too. And after that point, you're taking pictures and it just, it was a fantastic time with the rest of Canada and my family. And I will never forget that moment.